Hi guys and welcome to another Divi WordPress theme video. This is Jamie from System22 and WebDesignAndTechTips.com. Well, we had a good question. We've got a Divi th theme site up here, um, and somebody asked, "Can you explain about VW and VH in settings?" So let's go to a new page here. Obviously, I'm using the Divi theme. It's absolutely awesome. Keeps getting better and better and easier and easier to use. If you want to take it for a test drive, you can do so from my affiliate link below this video. Okay, so let's add a new section. I've got a section here. Let's just give it a background color so we can see it. There it is. And inside, let's just plump a little module. I'll put one column, one row. Yeah, let's put a call to action in there okay that's fine so each browser calculates the actual height and width of whatever screen you're viewing on that's how we have responsive sites that adapt differently on tablets and mobile systems so we've got a section here at the moment by default it's stretching a hundred percent of the viewable width here let's go into the settings and change them so you can see exactly what I mean so I'm going into the cogs, going into the settings, I'm going to go to design, I'm going to go to sizing. For width now, let's put 75 VW. So that's a viewable width. Now that should now make it only stretch to 75% of the viewable width. So let's put that in there, 75% there we go and as you can see it's jumped to 75% of the screen size there the width so that's 75 VW and although it's on my big screen here it's 75% it's also going to be 75% on a tablet and it's also going to be 75% on a cell phone and at the same time the it calculates the height of your screen or the viewable height of your screen so we can go in there we can put in a height it's designed sizing and this works for bootstrap this is just a, a regular setting and so we'll say height let's make the height 75 viewable height vh and as you can see it's now 75% of the viewable width and it's 75% of the viewable height. You may think that looks like more than 75%, but it's not because we're it's the whole screen. It's you've got to take into account the nav bar and everything up here. And again, if we go to tablet, it won't show too much here because these aren't showing you the actual size of the screen on the tablet it'll do the same for those also alright so you size your your section perhaps you want your section in the middle we're in our section selling let's go to our design and section alignment if you want to align it in the middle there that's fine if you want the actual contents that are inside to be vertically or aligned in the middle you can add a bit of CSS I'll put this CSS below it's a very easy bit of CSS you can tell it to display flex and columns and justify the content in the center so let me paste that in there and as you can see these contents are now in the center of our section here and again they'll be centered on a tablet and on the cell phone too. Now these sort of things are great for actual um, full screen hero sections etc etc. So if we go back into our section let's just change this back to a hundred percent to sizing. That should have been 75 VW viewable width viewable width there it's exactly the same right there okay let's change that back to a hundred percent as you can see 
it's 100 percent of the viewable area and also let's do the height the same thing let's change that back to 100 of viewable height and this is one you may need to adjust let's just save that a minute because although this is 100 percent viewable height it doesn't look like it's quite in the middle and again that's purely because we've got the header and everything at the top of our tab. So if we were to take it back to about 90%, that's about 10%, you can adjust it to however you want. We want it basically so the blue ends right on the bottom of our browser and at the moment it's, it's rolling down a little bit. So let's change it to 90% and see what happens. Remember we're working just on the section settings. So viewable height, let's change that to 90. Okay, that's a little better. We've still got a tiny little bit of blue there. We can actually use the arrows to back it up. And you see that little bit of black bleeding through there, just need that go up. That's it. So 89 viewable height is perfect for this one. And again, of course, it'll do the same thing for tablet. and cell phone so it's a really handy way of getting full screen and full width hero sections and all kinds of sections for your site or any size that you want using the VW command it's really VW and VH that's uh, visible height and visible width commands so I hope you found that useful if you have please give it a thumbs up share comment and subscribe to our YouTube channel if you're interested in web development, take a look down below. We've got some great free courses down there, as well as some premium courses with some huge discounts for our YouTube subscribers. So do check it out. Once again, this has been Jamie with System22 and WebDesignAndTechTips.com. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.